okay, definitely the award for the weirdest looking model. Um, but this is kind of a neat one because you can see a lot. So obviously we've got our tongue here. If we look at the teeth, you can see central and lateral incisors, cuspid, that's your canine, uh, first premolar, second premolar. Obviously the mandible gets cut off from there. Um, you can see the genioglossus muscle. You can see the hyoid bone, the thyroid cartilage, the laryngeal prominence, that's your Adam's apple right there. And then the cricoid cartilage comes all the way around. Uh, if you look on this side, again, hyoid bone, thyroid cartilage, you can see the right lobe. Remember, this is an anterior view here. So this would be the right lobe of the thyroid gland. And then obviously the trachea continues on from there. But interestingly, if I take this off, it does a nice job of showing the salivary glands. So sublingual salivary, sublingual, literally under the tongue. And this one, I just took it off and put it back here. Here's your mandible. That makes this submandibular, submandibular salivary gland as well. If we look at the posterior view, again, you can see the tongue. You can see the lingual tonsils, left lingual tonsil, right lingual tonsil. And you can see the epiglottis. Remember, the epiglottis is what folds over. So imagine food coming through like this down here and the epiglottis folds over to protect the windpipe and that food is going to continue all the way down the esophagus which you don't see here but of course it would be in this region right here Ugh. this one's weird <laughs>